morning guys and welcome to today's vlog. We've had a bit of a change of plan today for a reason. So we planned on, we're in Karuna right now, which is the largest city in Lapland, Swedish Lapland, which is where we are. And we'd planned on waking up this morning, having a wander around the city, doing a bit of exploring. However, Chris, when Chris went and had some dental treatment done just before we came away, he had a tooth and the dentist said it might be a bit sensitive, this tooth. Um, so just keep an eye on it basically but I think whatever he did like all the cleaning moving the to moving it things around I don't know what I think it's aggravated whatever was wrong with the tooth because since then you've had a really sensitive mouth basically this whole trip he's had a really sensitive mouth and then over the last four days maybe three four days it's gradually got a lot worse <laughs> so he's been having to take like the pain yeah it's turned from like a bit of sensitivity to like really bad pain and he woke up this morning <laughs> like a squirrel <laughs> like a squirrel on one side of the face. like a hamster he's got this big fat swelling so he's obviously got an infection an abscess something going on in there it's not fair to just be like come on we're on the once in a lifetime trip let's crack on <laughs> which isn't what i've been doing anyway but it's what you feel feel like you should do isn't it that's why you've been ignoring it today he can't and I said there's no point we're not going to enjoy walking around this town and this city and exploring whoa look at the icebergs oh, whoa look out there oh, that looks so beautiful oh we're going to come back and film that tomorrow we're going to go back and film that tomorrow it looks so cool um you're not going to enjoy it if you just keep ignoring this tooth we need to get it sorted out so we had a look what was in and around the area and we found a beautiful looking hotel we wanted to stay in places anyway didn't we on this trip so it's worked out really well a beautiful looking hotel that's got a spa on it as well and we managed to get the last two rooms because everywhere it seems fully booked at the minute doesn't it we struggled to find anywhere that actually had any availability but we managed to get the last two rooms and a spa booking as well for is it two till four yeah. the spa bookings two till four we've had a slow morning we've not really been doing much in the van this morning um so we're heading there now chris is going to drop me and the children off at the spa and Chris has also managed to get himself into a private dentist. A uh, private dentist, just a dentist. Um, it's a private dentist at one. So he's going to drop us off. We're going to get ourselves all organised and ready. I'm not sure how long the dentist is going to take, so he's going to drop us off first. And then he's going to head to the dentist. Hopefully, he'll be able to get some. Hopefully, you get that face sorted out. <laughs> Sat there like this right now. <laughs> If anybody knows, um, if anybody's had a type of infection like this before, an abscess, whatever it may be, you'll know the pain. Like, it, it just takes over everything. It's horrendous. Tooth pain is the worst ever. So, I'm really glad we've managed to get... Nothing's knocking it out, even. No, nothing's taking it away. I'm really glad we've managed to get a nice hotel, a spa. We'll have some dinner there tonight. And we're going to have a chill, nice, relaxing 24 hours. On, like, Chris's face, hopefully. So we just got into the spa, there's no one in here right now which is why I'm filming but um, we just got into the spa, got ourselves ready. Chris is still at the dentist, so we're hoping he doesn't miss too much of this session. But it's really cool, you get a towel and a robe. So it feels all nice and cozy. It smells really nice in here. Do you think the smart spas just have like this really nice like... Smells oranges. It does smell. It smells really nice, like beach and oranges and like tranquility. It smells delicious. Okay, are you excited? Yeah. yeah, listen, when we go through here, we're not allowed to scream and shout. Okay. We've got to be nice and calm. Is that a deal? Okay, but can I talk a bit slowly? Yeah, you can talk normally. You just can't scream and shout. Okay. Let's go. No problem. No problem. <laughs> so excited. Hey, look, come on. Okay. Let's go. Oh, my gosh. What? That's so cool. Okay, let's move the hand. I'll hold Jason's hand then. Hey, Jason. Wow. This is so cool. 
the waterfall coming out of the wall. James is so cute. There's a sauna. Oh, there's an ice bucket, Isabel. Are you doing the ice bucket? <laughs> I might do that. Come on, let's go. Finding all the saunas. <gasps> wow. Does it smell good? Wow. This is a steam sauna. That's so cool. Huh? Oh my gosh, look at the hot tub outside. Oh my goodness. Is this like the pool? I think this is the pool you get in. You getting in? <laughs> oh my gosh, Isabel's absolutely buzzing. I can't believe we found, I didn't even realize this place had one of those. So basically, it's an ice dip. Yeah, it's an ice dip. Should we go do it? Yeah, Come on. let's go. Oh, that is a lake there, isn't it? That's a lake. Yeah, that's Are you doing it? Yeah. yeah. I'm going to do it. Now. <laughs> see it. She's on a second thought. Let's go see it. Are you doing it? Just changing her mind. <laughs> Try to make it first. Let me just go dip my, my toe in it. <laughs> if you dip your toe in it, you'll never do it. Ezra, are you going to do it? Yeah. Alright, you go first. You go first. <laughs> I know, I know. By the way, just, just, I know I'm not, I shouldn't really have to, but I'm just letting everyone know that Mila and Jace are not in the water. Yeah. I'm not leaving them <laughs> while I film the girls. Right. They're just wandering around here. Okay, yes. Esme, are you doing it? No, but I'm saying, oh. I'll just run out behind Esme and just be straight after she's done it. Okay, are you standing there, Isla? Right. Here it is. Come on, I'll come okay. No, I don't know. Yeah, come on, let's do it. Come on. Go on. <gasps> oh, it's cold. Oh. <laughs> There's snow on there. Oh, it's just like a... Cold. Oh. Of course it's cold, it's the Wait, lake! Get it? <laughs> 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 just punch in! Oh, I can't, I can't, get me up! Okay, I'm going to get me up! Is that nice? Oh, that is so nice! <laughs> I'm going to go back to Isla. <laughs> I didn't do it, Isla. Isla's like, did they do it? No, uh, I didn't dare. Like, Look I at them. Do, do you think I'll be able to do it when Daddy gets back? I'll yeah. let them see me do it. Yeah, of course. Okay, I'll do it when Daddy gets of back. Of course. I promise I'll do it when Shall we just play in here then? Yeah, I want to. Those two are just going to, I think, this chill the pool, right? out there. Yeah. Well, I'm pretty sure this is the pool. It's really hot. It's like a bastion. Yeah, it's really hot. <laughs> okay, they've actually done it a few times now, but we didn't film because there's quite a few people around. But they are go about down. to go and do the hot, the cold dip. <laughs> Hi, Mila. <laughs> okay. Oh. <laughs> don't, don't slowly get in. Help. <laughs> She's like, no, you're okay. Esme's Wait. the boss. I'm the boss. Esme's the boss. She I just, stayed in she just stayed in. At least 15 seconds I was in there. <laughs> longer, probably. Probably longer. You ready? Fully yeah. in as well. Shoulders. Go on then. <sighs> if you get in slowly and just breathe, it's easy. Don't jump in. <laughs> it takes your breath away. And you get, you get possessed to get out. <laughs> Take a picture of you. We've got a picture. Come on, get out quick. <laughs> of course. Everyone were definitely waiting for us to get out of the hot tub. <laughs> as soon as we got out, everyone else got in. It's not really relaxing at a spa, is it, when there's five children in there I guess. <laughs> Mila! Mila's now eating her own body weight in carrots, dipped in green tea and honey. <laughs> Is that good? Yeah. <laughs> Cheeky girl. How excited are you for this on a scale of one to ten? <laughs> so we've got some treatments. This is a facial scrub. Coffee and chocolate. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to share these. We've got two of these to share. And then we've also got some bath foot salt scrubs. So we're going to go around the corner in a second. They've got some buckets around there. And then in the bucket you put your salt and a few of these balls. 
and get a nice salt scrub on your feet. And then we've got a body scrub in the changing rooms afterwards. Should we do the face masks? Yeah. Let's do it. Sorry if the camera's a bit blurry, it's really hot in here. But um, I just spoke to Chris and unfortunately he's had to have a root canal filling. He looked, I'm just gonna wipe that just in case it is the screen. He looked like he was in a bit of pain and his mouth is massive. It does. I really feel sad that he's missed out on this experience. We've still got an hour left in here, but um, by the time he gets here, gets changed and everything, he's probably only gonna have half an hour left. But um, it's so calm and relaxing in here, even with five children. It's really calm and relaxing. They do do times here. I heard um, when we were checking in, a few, can you see me? You probably can't. A young couple came in to ask if they had any spa slots available and they said they did. Um, one at two until four, which is what we were on. And they said, but that's a children's session, so to speak. And they're six till eight and eight till 10 are child free. They weren't bothered, so they booked onto this one, but um, yeah, there is like child free sessions. So I don't feel too bad. <laughs> Everyone knows they've booked onto one with children. Face of a guy who just survived emergency dental surgery. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm feeling a bit rough, not gonna lie guys. As you can see, my face is like fatter than a moose right now. So I had to, uh, I, had, <laughs> I had an issue fixed in the UK, as you will have seen if you follow our videos. Um, I had an issue with that tooth there that just had some decay on it basically. And they, we fixed it, it was all good. But it turns out that in the process of that happening, uh, I must have got an infection in there, which has just slowly been brewing and brewing and brewing. And then I woke up this morning after pain for a couple of days, and my whole face, my eye was like basically shut this morning. It's much better than it was. Um, and I went to an emergency dentist. Thankfully, the only one that would agree to see me after ringing around all of them in this town. Um, absolute legend, shout out to you if you're watching this video. Thank you so much for fixing my face. <laughs> but it took uh, an hour and a half, two root canals, and a lot of draining some nasty infection out of my uh, out of my, out of my gums to uh, to fix it. And um, now I've got morphine and uh, and I'm feeling all right. So the pain's gone. My face just feels ex 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 insanely fat and numb. Um, not my it's weird. More my mouth feels numb and my teeth. But so all the pain like moved up into my cheek and into my temple and across my forehead. So like just the absolute worst smasher. But I've just been in the spa for the last half an hour. I managed to catch the last half an hour and um, sitting in the steam was amazing, it literally just took it away straight away. So feeling so much better now. Got some antibiotics, so hopefully that's gonna resolve it all. My face will go back to normal by tomorrow, maybe, and, uh, and I can start eating again and feeling good. So, so grateful for this place today though. Oh, I wouldn't have been liking to, uh, well, I mean, it wouldn't have really made a difference, but being in the van or not, but um, that spa just helped immensely because when I came out of the hospital and I came here I was in so much pain in my head and, and everywhere that uh, my, my pain hadn't kicked in or anything and uh, I was just I just wanted I literally what I've never felt more like I just wanted to go <laughs> get me off this get me off this right now I need to get out of my own body um because it was just excruciatingly bad um apparently it was so infected that even when he was putting the anesthetic into my into my gums it was like putting so much pressure inside my tooth on earth is on my hair right now it was putting so much pressure inside my tooth that um, the, the, I can only describe the pain as like my brain was going to explode. It was the worst. Anyway, we're good now. We're going to go get our cabins checked in and get inside, check them out and enjoy the rest of this epic little spy retreat. Oh my gosh, this looks like blooming Santa Claus town. 
look how cute this place is. We're looking for our cabins. Uh, let's have a look. What number are we at? 60. So cute. This is one, guys. Okay. Oh, it's cold. <laughs> okay, this is for the girls. Here we go. Here we go. Watch your step, Mila. Good girl. Oh, oh, it oh it smells so cute. It smells like wood. Oh, this is so sweet. Oh, it's got bedrooms. Yeah. Oh, perfect. We've got a little table. So sweet. Isla begs in a room. <laughs> Isabel begs in a room. <laughs> Uh, Esme's on the sofa bed. Can I get my... <laughs> come on, Chase, let's go find our room. Mila, come on. Come on. Is it cute? Aww. Oh, come on, Chase. Go with Mama to find a little room. toilet. Okay. Thanks, Isabel. Ooh. 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 This is so cute. <laughs> oh my, look at that fridge. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. A home dryer. This is so cute. We've got a little kitchen. Camera's all fogged up. Give me two minutes. Right. Yay! Yay! We got bunks. Is this cool? This is well cool. Oh, I love it. So cozy as well. The lighting's not probably great, but oh my gosh, I feel so relaxed and happy right now. That's our experience. Yeah, yeah. Mila, come here. Come here. The girls are leaving and Mila thinks she's going with them. Come on then, go around that side. Oh, did your sisters leave you? What, darling? It's me. She gone? Oh, don't worry. Okay, but I've really wanted to experience a Scandinavian spa. I've read loads about them. And when you do like a, a top guide type thing, trying one of the Scandinavian spas always comes up as recommended. And to get up. So um, yeah, I'm really glad we got to experience it. It was absolutely gorgeous. My skin feels amazing. We got like the foot thing. We got the face mask, a, f a full body scrub for the end before your shower. It was just so lovely. So just checked in now. Chris has gone to the van to get the MacBook to get the vlog ready and sorted for this evening. And then we're going to head over to the restaurant and have dinner tonight. Oh, and now it's time for a three course meal. Just in time for my teeth to start feeling a little bit more normal, which thankfully, thanks to those painkillers, they are. It's so nice in here that I feel slightly underdressed. What do you? Um, <laughs> to be fair, we're the only ones in here right now. Yeah, but there, oh, I drink here. There is people starting to filter in. We came for dinner quite early because we were absolutely starving, absolutely starving after the um, the spa. But um, it's about half past five now. Anyway, um, we're, we're out of our comfort zone here, aren't we? No, what are you talking about? <laughs> Give over. You were like, where's the pizza? <laughs> no. It wasn't really. But um, yeah, the menu is very um, Scandinavian-ish. It's got ox on there, we've got reindeer. We got arctic fish. fish Sorry, dishes. Mm, okay, yeah. Go so we're gonna go for a starter. We've just ordered starters, but I can't even remember what everyone ordered. So I'll show you guys that when it comes. But I think the girls are gonna go for reindeer. What my starter? I wanna try. I, I think the girls it. are gonna go for reindeer. It, my starter. They reindeer topside. Oh, did you go for reindeer topside for starter? Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. Um, they're saying they should try it, and I agree. It's it's good to try everything. I don't know why I feel so weird about eating reindeer. It's just because it's so, 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 like, alien to me. It's because Rudolph's, you know, majestically fantasised about, you know, in our, in our culture, so, in, in our country, all our lives, so. Yeah, what are you going for main, Esme? Oh, I'm going for, um, reindeer. Kind of feel kind of bad. <laughs> you don't have to feel bad, it's, um, you know, I searched it's... that thing online, it looks like a steaky kind of meal, but yeah, I think reindeer. It, yeah. It will be, it'll probably, it'll probably taste I think it's like just going to taste like, so just like a steak. 
I can't decide. You see, I'm not going to go for ox. It's either. It's because it's just because the reindeer. Uh, are... Jace is buzzing that it's got two knives and fox. <laughs> Oh, we're Be careful of that. You do? Uh, what was you saying? It's because reindeer is like, you know, in abundance here. There's cows or not. Do you like That's where they live. Um, I can't decide between the Arctic fish or what was the other one? Reindeer. Uh, it would know it's the vegetarian meal. Uh, croquettes. No, I don't fancy croquettes. I'm not a croquette girl. No, I'm not, I'm not feeling that. But um, yeah, I'll show you guys the food when it arrives. I don't know how you're still awake. We've had to resort to baby bum. Mila was. Mm. Mm. Are you happy, happy? She's gonna fall asleep. Either. Yeah, she she is so tired because we went straight playing this morning, weren't we? And then we've been in the spa for the last few hours, and she's not had a nap today. It's like half past five. You do have a drink, darling. I've got you in here because I didn't want you to spill it. So, give me, give me, give me. So Say thank you. <laughs> okay, my um, I'm not quite sure what I, what I ordered. What, what did I order? Some kind um, of yeah. Read it out. So I ordered a vendacci roll, which is almond potato and. Vasta bottom cheese waffle topped with vinjachi roe, which is I believe caviar or some or caviar -ish, I'm not sure from the Bothian, Bothnian Sea served with sour cream, dried red onion and lemon. In fact four of us went for that. And we've, I'm, got, um, we've got four of these. I'm not sure I can do the caviar. I didn't realise. I don't think it's it, I don't, is it. I don't like caviar. I'm not sure. Um, Vendacci Row. Vendacci Row, is it pronounced? I'm not sure. I'm, I'm going to give it a go there. Oh, I changed my mind right at the last minute. The lady came over to take our order and I've gone for reindeer. Oh, I, I feel like it. I should try it. Like, we don't get reindeers at home. So. Yeah, like she was, she convinced me. She's like, it's so good. It's like everyone eats it here. It's like a favorite dish. And I was like, I can't decide between the reindeer and the cod. Well, well. And she said, it's, I think you should try the reindeer. I, I don't even know. Steak, I, feel. So I hope I like reindeer. Yeah, I feel like you can get cod at home, but you can't get reindeer at uh -huh. home, so we should try it. Yeah. Um, Jace has gone for meatballs. I, 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 want, I want meatballs and pasta, but we're going to say, but are we want the cake? Yeah, when you sit down at your tables, you've got like this little platter of like this cake and... Yumminess, bready, cakey, rice, crispy, nutty, seedy bread. It was just delicious. And they're on all the tables. <laughs> no, Jake. Did you say? Yeah. <laughs> they're on all the tables. So Jace is now looking around all the other tables. Been like, is someone going to sit there? I'm like, yeah, they probably are going to sit there. Anyway, um, Chris has had to go back to the van because the vlog will not render, which means it's probably going to be late tonight if it even gets up at all, which stresses me out so bad. There's nothing we can do about it, so I'm just trying to ignore that fact and enjoy our meal. Such a, this is like our Valentine's, it's not Valentine's Day today. This is like our Valentine's Day treat. So nice. <laughs> Okay, dinner's just started to arrive, or oh, main course, should I say. So, this is oh my God. the reindeer. Do you like it? The potato cake is so good. Is it good? Um, so, it's lingonberry. This top part here is the reindeer. The lighting is not great right now. And then, this is a potato and cheese and vegetable cake. And then, a lingonberry powder, blah, blah, blah. It actually looks really quite good. So Isla went for a risotto. I love Isabel went with reindeer as well. She's trying it for the first time. Okay, we're about to try it for the first time. It looks like steak. Isabel went for medium. Esme went for medium wild. I went for medium wild. It's like soft steak. Do you like it? Yeah, it's, good. <laughs> it's nice and sticky. It's not tough like steak, like steak. Yeah. That tough, that's nice. Is it good? <laughs> Mila and Jay's. Mila's gone fast asleep, but um, they went for meatballs with mashed potato and like a creamy gravy. 
and then a spaghetti carbonara. So Jay said he wants pasta and meatballs, so I guess I'll just have, yeah. I'll have half and half when Milo wakes up. It's like sweet Is it good? <clears throat> so and then Chris went for um, cod. Looks good. Nordic cod. Nordic cod. <laughs> Is that where this? No, no, no. Yeah, it was. No, it was. Yeah, yeah, it was. It was. Okay, so we we had a room together, me and the girls, and I said, um, when we get back to the room, I'll make us all teas and we can watch a movie and chill. Right, just, just, yeah. just, right. So we got back to the room. I set everything up. <laughs> I, I went over to the kettle, and I was like, guys, I'm gonna make us teas. Do you want one? And these two are sat on Roblox, and they looked. <laughs> they literally looked up and went. No, I don't want one. Nah, I don't and want I was, one. And I was just devastated. I was devastated. Anyway. And the next day we felt bad because she was telling us a story about how the like, oh, we don't want to go video on my phone of me making my tea <laughs> by myself. I was still for bad for seven time we're in a hotel. Our cabin or something. And she goes, girls, want a cup of tea? No. I go, nah, I don't want one. Me and I don't want one. But yeah, do you want a cup of tea? <laughs> anyway, whilst Isabel makes that, me and I there playing Roblox. I was actually MacBook just charging. I actually way prefer playing um, Roblox on my MacBook. It's so much fun. And I'm just playing Roblox now. Adopt me. And then new updates come out, which I'm so excited about. It's like the new camping shop update. And there's this. I'm going to buy this, but I have enough money. Enough money. And I wanted to show this. This is so cool. This is. Look, it's a van life. They've brought out a van oh, to adopt. Whilst we're on this van trip, he's even got an awning thing and solar panels and a... It, it's kind of like ours. <laughs> I also did a really good trade and got my dream pet, my neon owl. Also guys, recently a new Adobe pet came out and it's like where there was like these weird pets. So there was like a frog spawn, a fish with feet and a sheep with a long neck basically. And I did this trade, in fact I'll show you, wait a second. So I did this trade and I know it was quite a lose but I'm really happy with it. And then like 10 seconds later I did this trade and got, <laughs> and I got this mega frog spawn. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I've been trying to film for 20 minutes, but she keeps putting her music right, full that's blast. because Esme keeps turning her music on. Alright guys, we have an early start tomorrow morning, so I am about to go and get a shower and get ready for bed. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. <laughs> 